So today's first impression has been highly requested since it came out. It's called Too Faced Born This Way. It's an oil-free foundation that has medium to full coverage. I got this at Sephora. It retails for $39 and wow! And this packaging is very fancy. Glass container has a pump, always a plus in my eyes. It says here, according to a consumer study, 100% said the foundation blurred their imperfections, 98% said their foundation looked absolutely perfect, and 97% said this foundation provided natural coverage. There were so many colors to choose from. It's a little intimidating, but I picked up warm beige and that is right around the middle. Oh wow, that is thick. Holy cow. They're not kidding when they said this will give you a natural look. Like, this looks like my skin. Whoa. Okay, so first of all, it concealed my zits down here pretty fast. The redness around my nose and it looks so natural. Look at that. That looks like my skin. It's been about a minute and it even feels like my skin. This is insane. So impressive. Okay, so I'm gonna finish up the rest of my face and I'll be right back. So the foundation has completely set. I have not used any setting powder or setting spray and the skin just looks perfect. But um, that's just my first impression right now. Let's see if it lasts throughout the day. Oh my goodness, we have to do the flash photo test, of course. It looks so perfect. Okay, so I'm gonna wear this throughout the day. It is 11.38 in the morning. I'll check back in a few hours in natural light. It's 12.34 and I notice that the foundation oxidized a bit. I look a little more orange than how it looked 10 minutes after I applied it. So that's unfortunate. The shade is a little darker than my natural color, but come on. It still looks really good. Okay, I'll check back in a few hours. It is now 7.35. I have a special guest. Juliana. Juliana. And she's gonna help me with my review. I noticed that I'm starting to look a little oily, especially around my cheeks. You could actually see the light bouncing off my cheeks. And also the zit on my chin is starting to peek through. So it didn't last as long as I had hoped. So starting off with pros, packaging, awesome. I like that it has a pump. And I think it looks pretty, it looks kind of fancy. I do appreciate that it is unscented so you don't have that chemical aroma. The finish is absolutely beautiful. It looks natural, it has pretty good coverage, and it doesn't feel sticky or tacky, it doesn't feel heavy, and it is flash friendly. As for cons, it's not necessarily a long lasting foundation. Use a setting powder halfway through the day to touch up. Overall, I think this is an awesome foundation. I see this as an everyday foundation. As long as you blot or powder midway in the day, this would work perfect. It literally makes your skin look flawless like you were born this way. <laughs> Anyways, comment your thoughts below if you have tried this, um, some tips with using this product, and also let me know what review you would like to see next here on It's Judy Time. I'll catch you guys later, bye.